What's up guys, welcome to your 16th, I suppose, C++ tutorial in my series of C++ tutorials. Last time we finished the subject, subject enumerations, and um, this time we're going to talk about um, um, something. Actually, we're going to make your computer create files and write to them by itself. So, you're going to create a new source, source file. And actually, we're going to modify or add something to the basic information. So, as you know, you type include ISG, but now we're going to create another include statement. Include fstream. This will include the um, the properties that the fstream package has, and I suppose f stands for file, so we're actually including file stream. Now, as you know, you type uh, using namespace std, and as you know, it again and again, you create a, a uh, engine with a function that puts your program on standby. Okay, now we are going to type offstream um, example. Now type example dot open example dot txt and now create a C out statement Now type example to lesson signs um, your first sentence. Now you type example dot close. And I know that we have a lot going on here, so I'm just going to explain what we're actually having going on right here. First of all, we create a off stream, and uh, off stream I suppose that's um, output file stream so this means that the computer is going to output a um, file stream and the file stream we're talking about right here is example now you call the open um, uh, function that this um, class has that this file has off stream that we included up here um, and this function what is uh, original designed to do is to open a file stream and so actually we're trying to open, open example.txt but um, as we haven't got that file on our computer yet it'll create the file for us so that's actually what we're using the open um, function for N then uh, the computer outputs created file and then example which will be example.txt now and then it'll write to our file because we don't just want a empty file you type it'll uh, put your, uh, your first sentence in this file, this text file, and as you see, and as, as I suppose I learned you in uh, the user input tutorial, these two um, uh, lesson signs point in at uh, this uh, at this file on the uh, at this offstream example. So what we type in between these two quotation marks will be pointed into this file example, and then as you, and then. As we open uh, a stream right here, as we open the file stream example, we also have to close the file stream again, or else you get a you get a compiler error. Now hit F9, save this as um, writing, and now it says created file 0x22fed. Zero, and uh, yeah, actually, that's not what, we, what it was meant to say. So just there is this example thing, and type example.txt right here. I'm sorry about that. Um, actually, I just guessed that it would say example.txt, but um, clearly it didn't. It made a pointer instead, and I'll teach you about pointers later. I'm sorry, uh, my bad, and uh, that's actually kind of embarrassing. Anyway. Hit F9 again. 
Now it says created file example.txt and it says nothing else. Now go to the directory where you have your um, where you have your exe file and now you should have um, and a, a text document right here called example. You can try and erase it and run this um, and run our a exe file right here writing. Now it says create a file example.txt and then you see you get a um, you get a text file called example. You can try and open it and uh, yeah my computer probably won't respond to that um, right away because Camtasia Studio recorder just makes my computer so laggy. So um, yeah, we're going to wait for it to um, open the file. Now we're still waiting and waiting. And uh, yeah, I actually feel like this is going to take a long time. So uh, I'm just going to put the video on uh, pause for a second and then uh, start it again once my stupid computer finally opened the file. Okay, so now it finally um got this going again now as you see it says your first sentence just as we programmed it to and um now what if you would like um to create this example.txt file another place you see it will always uh, place the file in the same directory as um as where the .txt file is so now what if you would like it to place, place it at your local disk and type this uh, c colon slash in front of it you can try and hit uh, f9 right now create a file example sixteen. now we can try and open our local disk and now as you see you have a file right here called example with the text your first sentence in it so um, yeah I suppose that your um, tutorial on um, um, how to write files and write to them next time I'll learn you how to um, uh, make C++ write, uh, no, read the file for you and print it out in the C out statement so uh, yeah I'll see you next time